Okay, YouTubers, you probably know I don't do a lot of live video, but we have a, an emergency prayer request today. Uh, some of you know Cutworm59, his real name's uh, Stevie Ray Rains. He lives out in Arkansas. I think I got that right, because every so often I, I say he lives out in Indiana, or so I get those two confused. But anyway, that's beside the point. He is... Uh, not in good shape and he's never been in good health you know cutworm is the kind of guy he's kind of like me and dead eye dan and rusty acres and a lot of us who've lived hard and sometimes living hard don't, doesn't do your body well you know and I, I know that if you've ever been around cutworm he is liable to throw you in an unsafe vehicle and go down and try to stand it on one wheel and go across a one lane bridge and uh, you know just that's just cutworm bless his heart we love him for that um, I think he damaged himself quite a lot when he painted a car a few years ago. And, of course, these new paint products are much more dangerous than what I grew up on. We, we used to paint cars with enamel. It wasn't much of a big deal. You know, it, you could paint your car in your backyard. and Everybody did it. It wasn't much of a big deal. But now some of these paints are really hazardous. they got chemicals in there that you don't want on your skin. You don't want to breathe. And... I think he got a big whiff of that. That slowed him down a lot. And for the last few years, he's been moving at a slower pace. And lots of times he starts his videos out by saying, you know, I'm doing okay today. And he's been very, he's a very humble guy. Loves the Lord and talks about walking with Jesus every day. Anyway, he's in hospital now. I've got a, I've got a thing up from his wife. And, and Rusty Acres has gotten to be pretty good friends with cutworm in fact uh, i know he's been planning on making a trip out there to you know they're going to do some swapping and maybe pick up a truck or something like that hey shabby man i see you there so i'm just going to show you the message that uh his wife sent to rusty this morning i think i can get the camera in such a way that you can see that but it says uh still it says we went home thursday there were only four hours and he started throwing up blood again ambulance took him to the hospital when then he was airlifted to uams in little rock so he must be in arkansas we were we we're in the icu friday it was rough they're still having to give him some blood products thank you for your continued prayers we love you so it's been my experience with youtubers and prayers that you guys got some powerful things going on there's a there's a young lady here in my neighborhood who had a horrible car accident a year or a year and a half ago and I, I came on just to ask y'all to pray for her. I see you there. I see you, uh, Ward Tech Bear. Anyway, I see you, and I appreciate you. Um, but she's better now. She's she's very humble and, and walks very close with the Lord herself. And, I, and, and, you know, she says that having an experience like that will bring you to a new relationship with, with, the, with the good Lord. But anyway, Cutworm sounds like that's pretty serious stuff right there. I don't know if he's going to make it. You know, um, y'all been with me when Dead Eye Dan died and Mike died and um, the the guy that used to, that we we all took up money to raise, raise money. Hey, one lonely farmer, I see you, buddy. Cutworm, 59, he's in the hospital. He's in really serious shape. So, I mean, YouTubers have been with us. You prayed for people and, and done things to help people. And then this is old Cutworm now. And, and any of you that know him, you got to love him because he's just an amazing guy. So... That's all I came on here to say is uh, pre please uh, pray for Cutworm, for his well-being. Uh, I know if he doesn't make it, he's going to be walking with the Lord. But, uh, you know, we, we'd like to have him around a little longer if we could. So that's what I pray for. I appreciate y'all. I hope you're having a good day. And I'll leave y'all with that, and y'all can take it wherever you want. Thank you now. Bye-bye. All right, once again, the challenge. How do I stop this thing? Shut a little button right there.